The MRN is an organisation which is focused on developing community-based clinical trials. We developed from being a UK-only business to being an international business. Our vision statement says that we are aimed to produce uh, as many services as possible to support community-based clinical trials, administering drug in difficult and rare patient populations and diseases. And everything we do is really geared to, to speeding up clinical trials. So it, it's all about making trials more patient-centric, more manageable for the patients that they want, want to participate. We have a, a, a huge amount of history and experience in administering IMP in the home. Uh, we do a lot of work in rare diseases, we do a lot of paediatric work, and with our 38 country current coverage, uh, we, we get involved in very large global studies. We also offer uh, an on-site nursing service uh, called Site Nursing Support, and, and there it's uh, very focused on putting research nurses, coordinators, or other resources into trial sites to make them work more efficiently. If you can see patients from much further away, you can concentrate patients in a much small number of, smaller number of sites, which allows you to significantly reduce the cost of running your clinical trial. Probably about 50% of our visits involves giving a drug in the patient's home. Seeing them in the home means that it's on the patient's terms. They're in charge with, with, with the study and with the duration of those visits. Our rare disease portfolio uh, runs from lysosomal storage disorder diseases through to uh, rare haematological disorders, through to uh, Duchenne muscular dystrophy and other muscular uh, and neurological studies. Paediatric studies, of which we are doing more and more, are, are really important in that we need to make sure that the patient is, is safe, well cared for and managed and treated by nurses who have the appropriate qualifications or experience uh, in paediatric care. Um, and, and it needs to be able to fit with the family's life. And so it's important that we can go in and deliver that site level care um, to the patient delivering their drug, delivering, uh, ensuring that their blood samples and their biological samples are collected at the appropriate time and fitting in with the family's life. In order to do that, we decided to introduce some technology that would support our ability to operate in a global environment. One being um, MRN Tech, which is a uh, training portal uh, used by um, our study teams, but by our home care nurses, um, so that they can go in uh, into this web-based system and they can complete uh, various modules um, in, in training. Um, at this point, we now have the ability to use MRN Tech to uh, roll out global studies and very rapidly. The second um, technology that MRN has implemented is MRN Smart um, and that's a subject management and reporting tool. Which allows us to both collect images of the data that is um, recorded by the nurse in the patient's homes and manage that data. Uh, we partner with World Courier to be able to reliably deliver IMP. And we've set up some very detailed processes to ensure um, that the IMP um, has full accountability and temperature control between the pharmacy and the patient. We do occasionally have the need for storing IMP in the patient's home um, and we have a unique solution for doing this um, which is called MyCubics. This is a temperature monitored fridge um, and the monitoring is done at a distance by 3G so we can observe the temperature on a portal. None of our competitors have access to this uh, equipment. We've always looked at setting up our services to, to a high level of quality. We run a very complex quality management system. Inspection readiness and, and, and audit readiness is, is very much high up our agenda. We take a very strict approach to risk on, on the trials that we run. Um, and I think that sets us aside from, from some of the other uh, companies that, that, that are out working in the same sector. Uh, we're seeing uh, a lot of requests come through from, from different and new, uh, both pharma companies and CROs all the time. Um, and everybody's trying to, to do the same thing, to try and speed up their clinical trials, to, to, to offer a better healthcare package for their patients and, and ultimately get their products onto the market sooner. And that's, you know, everybody's looking at, at companies like MRN uh, to be able to do that. We're the market leader in the, in the sector. 
Uh, we've grown our turnover on annually by over 30%, um, and we've seen no reason why we couldn't carry on growing by that sort of number or more uh, in the foreseeable future. Over the next 10 years, I think we'll continue to see the community-based trial model develop and grow. Our customers, both pharma and biotech, are realising that home trial support and our site nursing services are a viable means to meeting the challenges that they have around patient recruitment and retention in clinical trials.